party's best outcome for the Speaker of the House situation? To have one. <laughs> you want to make so to one? those who thought it was a good idea to throw over the Speaker, please reevaluate. It was not a good idea. To those who believe that if we pull the plug on Ukraine, the world gets safer, you are wrong. Almost everybody on the Republican side believes it was a disaster to withdraw from Afghanistan, that we've turned it back over to the Taliban and Al-Qaeda elements are now there planning to hit us. So if you think it was a disaster for Biden to pull out of uh, Afghanistan, your desire, Republican desire, to pull the plug on Ukraine is 10 times worse. You're making Biden's mistake on steroids. You have to assume that Putin will not keep going. Well, you're very naive if you think that's the case. If you think giving him part of Ukraine by force of arms stops him, that's crazy. He has said there are other places he would like to go. And if you want to avoid a war between the United States and Russia, make sure he gets defeated in Ukraine and doesn't attack NATO. And I think that's coming if he wins in Ukraine. So we need a Speaker of the House. I'll let the House figure out how to do that. But I'm hoping that people who created this chaos in the House understands that chaos in, the, in American politics emboldens the bad guys. I hope the Biden administration understands that a weakness anywhere emboldens the bad guys everywhere. I am confident this all started from Afghanistan. I am confident the Iranians picked now because they want to stop this effort to normalize Saudi Arabia, Israel, and the United States. I am confident that if we pull the plug on Ukraine and let Putin get away with this and not defeat him, you will have more war, not less. If you had told me when I was in the Air Force in the 80s serving in Germany during the height of the Cold War that we could destroy half of the Russian military, which has been done, NATO would be bigger and not lose one American soldier for 5% of the American military budget. I thought that was not possible. That's exactly what's happened. The Ukrainians have destroyed half of the combat capability of the Russian military. They've taken half the land back, and we haven't lost one soldier. And the money we spent is less than 5% of our own budget. We need to continue to help Ukraine. I, to those who believe that it doesn't matter to us, you're wrong. Because if we don't get Ukraine right, China will, as sure as I'm standing here, go into Taiwan. And if we reward Putin and let him get away with this, he will continue. 